Hey guys, Figs here with uh, Figs Challenge Day 2. For those of you who don't know what the Figs Challenge is, it's me, Figs, trying to lose some weight. So, this is Figs Challenge Day 2. Ah, I feel good. I just came from a shower after going for a run with my little dog. She's just the cutest little dog in the world. Just look at this face. And we ran around for about 25 minutes or so, just kind of jogging, light jog, running. We had a couple of sprints in there just to get our blood moving, so it was a good time. Now, I told you guys that last night I went to a barbecue, and they had tons of food there. <laughs> You said we got segway. <laughs> like, like, there's pasta, and there's triscuits, and there's grapes, and there's cheese, and I want to eat it all. Look at all those delicious, and there's cookies over there. Cookies, cookies, and soda, and that man. They also had a pretty cool bonfire. Taco Bell. Yeah, now it's a big fire! Oh. Well, my, my skin, skin is burning off. Let's the mattress caught on fire. The rest will catch on fire. Oh, two people. It will. It will. <laughs> Guys, if it gets out of control, I'll put it out with my body. And even Jesus made an appearance. <laughs> it is not big enough. I'm just not sure how to fix it. We can set my car on fire. Yes! Nah, that's not Jesus. That's my friend Sam. He's going to college in Rochester, New York and we just had a going away party for him. Now I did pretty good, I only had one sandwich, but there was a lot of meat there, so I had a little bit more than I probably should have. Um, however, I didn't go too overboard. I think I had a good amount. I'm pretty happy with the way I handled myself. I didn't really eat uh, too many chips, and actually, on the, on the really good note, I didn't have any soda at all, I just drank water. So overall, I think I did pretty good at the barbecue. So tonight, I'm going to this Japanese hibachi place called Fujiyama's with a bunch of friends of mine and it might be a little bit of a challenge because Chinese food, Asian food is one of my weaknesses really you know the fried rice and you know they have like fried everything really so what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to go for the healthier choices the good thing is that it's hibachi which means it's going to be all grilled so I'll probably go for the grilled chicken, the white rice, skip on the fried ice cream that they usually have and eat some salad so I'm hoping that this trip tonight would just be another test that I can overcome so I put my first video up on YouTube and Facebook and I got a couple of comments. I was kind of surprised because I didn't think I would get any. So thank you for those who watched my video, who commented, and who subscribed to my YouTube channel. It really helps to know that I have people who are watching me so I can continue making these videos. I even got to talk to somebody who watched one of my videos and we started talking about some of the foods we struggle with. Now she said she was going to her mother's house to have some chicken pot pie, which is one of her favorite meals. And her plan was to not eat a lot beforehand so that she can indulge a little bit tonight. Now that's a great idea. If you know what you're up against, plan ahead. Maybe for you it's not eating a lot beforehand so you can indulge a little bit. Maybe for you it's eating beforehand so that way your stomach's not rumbling while you're at the food table. Whatever it is, it's always good to have a plan whenever you're going to a place where you know there's going to be food that you're going to struggle with or be tempted by. Well, thanks for watching my video, guys. This is Fix Challenge Day 2. I'll be putting up another video tomorrow, Fix Challenge Day 3, and we'll see how this goes. Thanks again. Talk to you later.